today on the rain farm folks we are going to be making a patella stew and uh, this is the praying hand banana we're going to go ahead and take a hand go ahead Luva we are up high on a ladder right now cheers Luva beautiful looking and here's a flower on it, nice and tall. <clears throat> the praying head banana rack. We're gonna open it up. <laughs> oh yeah, how cool is that? Lovely. Let's make some. Patella stew. Patella stew. Here we have our um, peeled green banana. Yeah. Praying head bananas. <laughs> Uh, sitting in a salt bath. Yep, salt water. Salt water. And then here we have the peels which are going to go to the soldier flies. So here's grated green bananas and Sean's adding... Achote oil. Achote oil. Oh, it's a beautiful colour. Very nice. Onions that are being sautéed for the stew. So here we have a bit of garlic that's going to go in the stew. We totally love garlic. Mm, it smells really garlicky. <laughs> this here is a um, pork butt that um, was pressure cooked in a chote. Yeah, and water and some garlic and onions. Mm -hmm. So we're going to cube it up and put it in our stew. Yum. Nicely cubed up. Here it all goes into the bubbling pot. I added uh, some more achote oil to it. Just added some black olives. Two tomatoes. One can, two cans. Two cans of tomatoes. can of tomato paste and you can see the olives in there and the pork but the color looks absolutely beautiful and over here we have um, dumplings that are made out of green banana dumplings green banana dumplings and we will add later we're just testing one here's a mixture over here and then we already added some of the um, green banana a little bit of green banana in here too too yeah Here's our beautiful pot of uh, patella stew and these are the dumplings uh, boiling right now. We're taking the dumplings out and then they're going into the stew. Mm -mm -mm. So Luva, I'm going to go to the garden and pick some herbs. What would you like? Culantro and chives and some Japanese parsley. Okay, be right back. Okay, bye. We have some um, cilantro. It's, it's like a cilantro, but um, smells 10 times stronger, tastes like 10 times stronger. We had a hard time growing cilantro um, on the island, but cilantro, never even heard about it before, is uh, fantastic and works really well for us. Thank you, cilantro. And here we have our Japanese parsley. Uh, the recipe didn't call for it, we really, really love it. Uh, we're going to put it in there. It's beautiful. Look at the leaves on it. Giant, giant Japanese parsley, friends. And uh, here we have bed of green onions. So I'm going to take like five. So the cilantro and the Japanese parsley are chopped up and already in the stew. And um, Red and white green onions. Wow. Red and white green onions just picked from the garden. Absolutely beautiful. These you're making a little bit bigger, huh? Mm -hmm. Nice. Absolutely beautiful colors. And the smell is outstanding, huh, Baba? It's herbal right now. Mm -hmm. You got a pot of rice going? Pot of rice going right here and yum yum. Soon it's gonna be lunch time, and we'll take some to work and share with the folks at work. So here we are with our um, stew and 
rice and we're gonna go ahead and try it. Here we go. Do it taste, Mama. Go, 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 Mama, go. Let's see. Mm. Thumbs up. Olives, banana dumplings, no rice for me. Chunks of pork. Mm. Mama gets thumbs up. It's a great day on the island. Ha, ha, ha.